And it's funny because uh, George Harris was also influenced by people like Dwayne Eddy and Chet Atkins that became good friends of mine. But uh, we all just sort of learn off of each other. And, uh, and the sound of this guitar sure brings me back to that. It's just all those little things like that that George Harrison would do. It's just those accent places, uh, George Harrison, and uh, what a wonderful guitar player. And John Lennon as well, Paul McCartney as well. They were just savants uh, as nobody lived, of course Ringo. Uh, they all produced a sound within each other, within the group. They had their own thing going. And uh, I mean, the, these licks that George had, maybe it's not quite right, but... That's more like it. You know, and I always want to add another chord, but there was no chord. It's like two chords, you know. I, mean, I want to go. Anyway, it's just amazing. It's kind of hard to do it all at one time. There, there's only one Beatles, and uh, they influence everybody, you know, and even me, church kid, you know. But uh, the way they uh, play their chords, like, uh, and the, his um, counterpoints that he would have, and his bass line. that was Eric Clapton wasn't you know uh, but the Beatles uh, what what a great influence they've made on all of our lives